so, you know, per usual, you be having boxing fans out here saying, well, Canelo can be a better BF. Canelo can be a better BF. All right, then, if that's the case, man, why don't Canelo Alvarez just fight Art the better BF? You know, if that's, if that's the case, you know, you know, he said, you know, I only want to fight if, you know, take the winner and Beaver win. You know what I'm saying? Like, all this, this, oh, Ryan Garcia say this, or this guy say this, or this fan say this, that Canelo can beat better BF, then, hey, man, why don't better be, why don't Canelo go fight better BF? Why don't y'all hold him accountable? And that'd be my problem with it. Y'all, y'all only hold the guys accountable that y'all don't like. You know, if, you know, the same thing that was going on with Benavidez for years. Oh, Canelo easily beat Benavidez. Okay, if it's that easy, why don't he do it and add to his legacy? That's what I don't understand. It ain't just Canelo. Same thing with Javante Davis. If it's that easy and these dudes are trash, do it. You know what I'm saying? Do it. That's not, we don't have to, we, this ain't, you know, Rocky Marciano fought, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Jack Johnson. No, this ain't no hypothetical. This shit can happen. All these dudes around that we want to see these guys fight are around the same weight class. We actually can see this shit happening. You know, and that's and that's what be that's what be killing me about a lot of these situations in boxing because a lot of these dudes that sit here and you know. Oh, he can do this. Oh, well, let's see it. Let's see it go down. That's what I want to see. I want to see it go down. Why do can't Canelo take challenges? He ain't earned the right to, to pick and choose his opponents. I've always said that. He has not earned the right to do so. He ain't really had a hard fight in his life. All his fights have been scripted like the first 20 plays of the NFL offense. Everything has been scripted, so why shouldn't he go ahead and do this? You said you wanted to fight the winner of Beaver 1. Look, better BF didn't look as good. It could have been age. It could have been a knee. It could have been a combination of things. It could have been Beaver, but guess what? Winners win. He still found the way to win. He still found the way to win. So he clearly, you know, I don't know if it was the knee. That made him a step behind or whatever. Should he have, you know, petitioned? Hey, much water. Should he have petitioned to wear a wrap? You know what I'm saying? That's the question. Should he have petitioned to wear a wrap? Who knows? Maybe he needs some more time to heal off the meniscus. You know, depending on the grade or tear of the meniscus, it matters. But, um, well, yeah, Canelo should take him, take him, take him. Especially if it ain't no rematch, go ahead and beat him. Now, he said that he would pick David Benavidez. I mean, Arthur better be able to beat uh, David Benavidez. So, he obviously is not a fan of David Benavidez. He'd pick Marvin and Marcy to beat David Benavidez. He would. Did pick Marvin and Marshall to beat David Benavidez, but you know, nonetheless, uh, you know, like I said he should he should have to go out there and walk that walk. And this is why a lot of fighters can't don't care about the fans and the fans holding them accountable because it's going to be twenty different uh, opinions, which it should be one or two ways. Do it or don't do it. And most of us should be on the side. Hey, man, you should get in there and do it. We want the best possible fights. When we had the best possible fights in boxing, everybody win from content creators to old media, new media members, to fans win, the sport win. The sport is in heavy rotation. It takes the, st the stage. So why shouldn't Canelo go for undisputed in two-way classes? Everybody say he can beat them. Everybody say he can whoop them. Let's, let's see it. Let's see it. That's my thing. Let's see it. Let's see. Oh, Canelo can beat him. And Canelo, man, Canelo will get squashed. Canelo is too small. Well, be, how strong Beaver was in his conditioning, his conditioning was great. Canelo ain't never had no conditioning. Canelo ain't never had no conditioning. Canelo get tired every fight he in. 
I don't know if it's the Modellos, the Coronas, the Enchiladas. I don't know what it is. But he gets tired on every fight. You know, he that that you know better BF can get back to what he once was, which I'm not sure he can. Even that version of better BF be Canelo Alvarez. Even that version. Canelo can't move like Beaver. He don't have a height or, or how to height that Beaver got or the lane. Beaver was a strong motherfucker. I give him that. He's strong. You know? So let's see it. You know, Canelo should go out there. And make it happen. If they don't rematch, I think a rematch should happen. If they don't rematch, Canelo should make it happen. Canelo should definitely make it happen if it ain't no rematch. Tired of hearing, oh, Canelo can do that, but he never does nothing. <laughs> Benavidez, Morel, uh, Beaver rematch, uh, Arthur better be at. Oh, Darbachenko, he would have beat Darbachenko. Let's see it. What can he tell Fred? Don't talk about it, be about it. <laughs> Don't talk about it, be about it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Too often, too often, we talking, we talking. Too often we talk. We can get this, we can get this shit over, you know, expeditiously. But I think a lot of fighters and a lot of fans are comfortable with just all oh, the opinion being, oh, he'll beat him, he'll beat him, he'll beat him, just with the opinion or the perception that I'll beat him. Go in there, fuck around, and find out. He'll be another year older next year. <laughs> I want to see it. Because better be able to talk about going up the cruiserweight anyway. Yeah, you was talking about going up the cruiserweight anyway. Yeah. Just because everybody think it don't mean it's going to happen. How many times we seen, especially in here in the fight, we think was the guy was a heavy favorite he'd lose. Or he'd get a gift. Better be able to knock Canelo out. He don't have a condition. He don't have a condition. And he don't have the firepower, the footwork to keep Better be able. Beaver had the footwork. He had the he had the speed and the combination punches. And the dude looked like Better be able. He looked just as fresh as when he was face wise as he walked in the ring and when he walked out the ring. That was the wild thing about it. He looked good, just as fresh. That was the crazy thing about it. So, yeah, let's 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 see it happen. Let's see it happen. Oh, Canelo will do this. Man, Canelo won't do shit because he won't get in the ring with nobody. Let's make this shit happen. He ain't fight better be at fight Ben and Morale winner. Why not? You know, you had your phone with Berlanga, you know, Callum Smith, and, you know, them guys. You know, you know, that's probably going to be his last fight. Win, lose, or draw. Probably going to be his last fight. But, you know, I think better be have deserved to be on that pedestal. Uh, fight the best. That's what I believe. I think he deserved it. Really do. So, but, uh, you know, so to be put on a hell of five performance. Uh, the rematch should be, you know, inevitable. It should be, you know, chiseled in for whenever they both healthy enough to come back. But, you know, after that, or if that don't happen, well, Canelo need to get in. Don't want to fight Bud. Don't want to fight Benavidez. Don't want to fight Morale. Don't want to fight Archer Better Be I think if Beaver would have won, he still would have found the way not to rematch Beaver. 
So now the great question is, if they do rematch, who is Canelo going to fight in May? That's the great, that's the great, the great debate. Who is he going to fight in May?